Hi everyone, welcome to Naresh Technologies. This is Srinivas. In the last session, we discussed so basic example of a graphics programming in C language. Now, in this session, we will see some more examples how to work with the graphics. Here it is. Now, in this one, in this session, the first program is on the screen how to print different messages or a same message in different colors. Suppose this is a screen. We discussed in the last session that screen is represented with the pixels format and here it is 100, 200, 300, 400. So, like this and now here it is I want to print a message in different colors in different locations. For example, I will start here message we are printing simply welcome to Naresh IT Naresh IT and here it is the same message I want to print in a different colors and next in different colors I want to print so like that how many colors we have right with all the colors I want to print message like this message okay this is this is our concept how to print and what are the functions we need to use to print like this to print pixels very very important pixels with the help of pixels only for example first pixel i'll start with a 50 and 100 consider x coordinate y coordinate next uh, we can increase it 25 25 pixels or uh, 50 50 pixels but x coordinate always the same see always right here it is on the same point x coordinate 100 only you can take but only y coordinate is increasing every time y coordinate here it is you can increase 25 if it is not sufficient we can go for 30 35 40 and all okay but sir what are the functions we have to use to display the information on the screen in gui programming for that here it is one function is a out text xy function is there out text xy display display a message on xy coordinate this is okay i'll show you and one more thing set color set color one function is there it is taking it is taking integer color sir generally color is a name names we are representing in string na? right here it is it will set a drawing color whatever you draw foreground color either you draw shapes right or you print any messages the drawing color that it will set sir color is in a string format na? so then why sir it is taking in teaser here it is sorry here it is taking two coordinates x coordinate and y coordinate and message in c language that string we are representing with the help of a character pointer any message you can pass that will be displayed on x y coordinate and here it is in a set color why it is representing in colors why colors set represented in integers represented in integers simply here it is enum enumeration set colors set is there colors set right here it is colors starts with a black and next one so many colors are there blue color blue color green color cyan color red color magenta color magenta sir how many colors are present and so on write yellow and next last one is a white see in enumeration set in c language right here it is all these elements represented with a constant integer values for black constant integer value is a zero for blue it is one for green it is 2 like that it will go for yellow it is 14 and for white it is 15 
okay. These are the colors set. Here enum enum is a set enumeration set and here it is to represent colors. Sir, what are the advantages of enumeration set? Means, so generally instead of writing black, blue, green, cyan, red, magenta every time, I just want to print a, uh, 15, 15 messages in 15 different colors, just imagine. In that situation, suppose if you use one for loop, with the help of for loop, using constant integers, easily we can apply colors to such type of messages, set of messages. But here it is, if you go for values directly, elements like black, blue, green, cyan, red, you have to write 16 lines of code. Instead of that, if you go for integers, in one line you can write the entire code, right. So, nothing but means what program implementation become very easy with the help of enumeration set. This is one advantage. If you see the program, then you will get more clarity on this, okay. This is we are using. One is a out text x y, second one is a set color we are using and these are the colors and of course no need to no need to remember all these colors because anyway we will represent with the help of constant integer values only, okay. See here, suppose here it is I want to use that set color and uh, out text x y. Here it is, here it is to repeat the for loop I am declaring one integer variable i and next coordinates initially coordinates x coordinate is a 100, y coordinate suppose I will start with a 50. We are repeating the for loop i value starts with a 0 because a colors starts with a 0. Sir, Actually, color 0 color is a black color, na? background is a black and on the black background, we cannot print any message with the color black, yes. So, we can start with 1 and how many colors are there? 16 colors. So, less than 16, I plus plus and every time here, we need to set the color, set color. Suppose, if you go for names. If you go for names like a red, green, green like that, right, 16 statements you have to write, set color message, set color message. Instead of that, if you go for constant integers like i, i means what here it is 1, 1 representing blue color, so automatically it will set the blue color. Next, whenever i value 2, 2 is representing green color, it will set automatically green color. And next we are printing the message out text x y and here the message I want to print at x y coordinates, x coordinate is a 100, y coordinate is a 50 and here it is the message is welcome, welcome to Naresh IT is a message. Next here after printing the first message in a blue color next message I want to print, but we cannot use the same coordinates x is equals to 100 and y equals to 50. We should change the coordinates, x coordinate no need to change, it is constant always as we discussed in the, um, in the picture diagram, but here it is y coordinate we need to increase, y we are increasing by 30 pixels, y equals to y plus 30, so like that we are increasing. Now, I am compiling and executing this one, compile and run. See look at this output, it is printing 15 colors in 15 colors, 15 messages it is print, I mean same message it is printing in 15 different colors. This is how to print a message in different colors and next one, here it is a small modifications on this small modifications. Suppose, using out text x y and set color, set color, here we are writing one more program. First, I am setting the color, background color I want to change. If you want to change the background color, set b k color, this is background color. How to represent? Suppose, I want to set c on color. Actually, 
the constant integer value of cyan color is a 3, but we can write a directly cyan no problem. Now, color is a cyan background color. Next, I want to set the foreground color set color foreground color is a red color just consider foreground color is a red color. Now, at a specific location out text x y x coordinate is a 100 y coordinate is a 100 here it is I am printing one message. So, what is that message suppose welcome to welcome to Naresh IT message we are printing it will print in a red color. Next here I want to print one more message out text x y out text x y and here it is at some location x coordinate 100 only y coordinate I am taking 300 300 next one press any key press any key to continue one message one message. So, these two messages it will show in the means cyan background and with a red foreground color. Next we should stop the screen we should stop the screen to check this output get ch function I am using and next whenever they press any key I want to change the background color suppose consider and all the messages I want to clear generally in CUI in general C applications we use a clear screen function to clear, but here it is clear device one function is there it clears the screen after clear the screen I want to change the background color and foreground color now background color I want to set is a red color and foreground color I want to set is a green color. So, with the green color now I want to print one more message out text x y same coordinates 100 and 100 I want to print one more message one more message for example, number one training institute we are printing and next out text x y 100 comma 300 press any key to close and then again one more get ch already we have written and then whenever they click on any key then get ch function will collect that key. So, very simple this program first on the cyan background and with a red color we are printing two messages welcome to Naresh IT press any key to continue. Next I am clearing the screen next again background color is a red foreground color is a green. Now, here it is we are printing one more message in the same locations and press any key to close. So, whenever they click on any button then automatically close graph function execute then it will put to an end. See just compile and run and run here it is look at this color is a cyan color background and foreground color is a red color it is printing welcome to Naresh IT press any key to continue. Next whenever you press any key now look at this background color has changed to red color on the red color screen it is printing the message number one training institute press any key to close whenever you press enter it will close ok. Sir the program is ok, but I just want to change the fonts sir nothing but the font size I want to increase then what we have to do simple C here here it is one method is there one method in a graphics in graphics set text style one method is there this is the method set text style is a method right here it is set text style it is taking three arguments set the current text characteristics font we can set directions we can set character size we can set sir what are the fonts fonts again that is enumeration set see enumeration type font names 
and here it is the total 5 fonts default, triplex, small font, sans serif, gothic. Okay. Simply sir, uh, I am unable to remember all these things. You can represent with the help of constant integers like 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. These are the fonts. Right. Suppose it is, sir what about a direction? Only two directions available, horizontal direction and vertical direction. Horizontal direction means left to right, vertical direction means what bottom to top because on the x y coordinates, x coordinate we are writing x axis like this, x axis left to right, but how we will write a y axis that we are writing from bottom to top in this direction. So, that is why they have given like this, Okay, that is and next sir what is the size? size is character size will increase slowly you can give the numbers from 1 to 10 the size gradually increases depends on the integer you have given depends on integer you have given it increases gradually okay this is now i want to apply this apply see here first set characteristics set text style font name i don't know simply i am giving zero is a default font and next is our direction is a horizontal direction all are capital letters because constants we are representing in the capital letters only in any programming language sir what is the size suppose we are giving size is a four and next here it is in the next time we are applying that set text style now, here it is I am giving 1, 1 horizontal direction, vertical direction we will see later, horizontal direction and next here also the size I am giving that 4 or 5, 5 I have given, this is. Now, I am compiling this program once again, compile and run. Now, look at the output once, here it is, the font size is more. So, that is why welcome to it is not showing clearly. So, I am decreasing the font size, I am decreasing the font size just here it is I am giving 2 and here it is I am giving 3. Now, just compile, compile and run. Now, observe, see now the font size increased, welcome to Naresh IT, press any key to continue. Whenever you press the key, now look at this. Now, the font has changed. Number 1 training institute and press any key to close. So, whenever you press the key, so then it will be closed automatically. Okay. So, this is how to set colors, how to set fonts, how to set background colors, how to set background colors. Thank you for watching this video. For more videos, Please subscribe to Naresh IT channel. Thank you. Thank you all.